live. Are they gonna pick, are they gonna, because I sing so well, they're gonna get me for copyright? Probably. Bobby Brown's gonna come after me? Most likely. Bobby, come after me. You can't just fight Bobby Try Brown all the time. To make it right. So what's up, you guys? We may or may not be crazy. I don't know. This reminds me of the time that we decided we were going to make 400 coasters with Quick Coat. 13, for, 13. <laughs> for that um, the thing. And it was not our best moment. Anyways, we got to make 90 of these guys. Just 90. I mean, it's only 90. So that's what we're about to do. Um, part one, because what is this a blizzard? If it sounds like Jeff has Tourette's, it's because um, he's listening to his own music. Today is Monday. Today is Monday. We are early. My bad, but we got to get these knocked out. And also, I'm getting inventory in today from. I already got color passion in, just resins slated to be delivered today, and something else. Hopefully color obsession, because it was shipped first. Bang, if you're watching, just saying. Not sponsored, but if you're watching. What's up? What's up? Okay, so client wants New white gold and gold house. trinket dishes. So these were my sample pieces. And she likes them. So some of them are going to be kind of like this. Some of them are going to be kind of marbledy like this. Just a whole number of ways of doing a whole number of things. Um, for this, we're going to use the Illumilite White dun, dun, dun. from Illumilite because um, it cures up in 10 minutes and... It cures up in 10 minutes, so. Can you reuse the cup after you've mixed? If you get it, I probably wouldn't. All right. I just probably wouldn't. No, that might have been a question that somebody would have asked. Before we do this, I want to show you what I did today. I want to work this into resin somehow, but... Whatever. I'm getting into some textural stuff. And I wanted to know what you guys thought about my this. Ooh. Ah. Jeff says it looks most like um, dragon scales. I did film the creation. Okay. So here's what's going to happen, B. I'm going to mix up the gold. And you're going to mix up the white and you don't have to put anything in it because it just is. And then we're going to fill these bad boys. If we want to do like puddles, half and halves, whichever. Um, this resin, if you didn't see my review the other day, it's a two minute working time, 10 minute cure time. All right. So what do you mean? I'm mixing gold. I'm mixing gold. You're mixing white. So... All you got to do is mix it. Oh. Mixing it in there? Yeah, you're just mixing the two parts. We're mixing eight ounces each at a time. I may come off that and go back down a bit if, if it seems like it's a bad idea to do this much. It's super thin, so it, it combines with itself pretty quickly. Introducing. Oh, there it is. So, let's get to mixing. You like the dragon scales? Super. Day is going amazing. So, it's already starting to get warm. Yeah. I'm going to go ahead and mix the gold into it. And I need to mix white into mine? No, it, it is white. 
Oh, I get the easy. I get the little kid version, so I don't have to get too messy. Well, it's only because you're... Why is that not mixing? Well, because the paste Whoa. is super thick, and the resin is super thin. It just takes a little bit longer for it to mix in fully. I'm also going to mix in a little bit of... Yeah, this is getting hot. Yeah, go ahead and um, so... make sure it's fully mixed, though, because I feel like... No, probably don't see a swirl. I mean... You still have to it's scrape so the sides thin. and the bottom and the stick. And yeah, it does start to get warm super quick. Okay. So I just pour it in. Yeah. You can start pouring in, pick one, and then I'll start pouring in one. My goodness, I may have made too much for just this amount of mold. I don't know. It's hard to see where all the. I know that's why I, I try gotten. to like. So I'm like peeling up the edges. Like I don't I don't know if it's clear or if it's gold or air. And then on this one. I put quick coat in the base of it to give it some structure, but um, I need to go ahead and use it. I don't have any clear yet. That's okay. This will just be the first part of the next one. Do we have alcohol? Right. First ones are in. So you'll actually be able to see this cure just live on camera. It'll start turning white. It looks super cool. Um, right now, I'm just kind of pushing and poking the edges to make sure that we have all the bubbles out. This one, I don't need to because it just is. Look, that one's already turning white. Yeah, that's so rad. That one's doing it now. Oh, blah, blah, blah. That's so rad. Listen, especially with Jeff being um, impatient. This is like my favorite stuff. This is <laughs> ideal. So Clara, I was wondering on the UV for this as well. I don't have any, I don't have any final answers on it, but um, you don't have to put fire on this? Well, it's so thin, it just works through the bubbles. This is actually a casting material. And so since, I don't worry that. I know, it looks like, it looks like air pocket. You know, it looks like it's empty. So, something. Oh, um, I mean, they sell it as a white material. I don't, I can't find any, documentation on the UV resistance of it. But, oh, TG says it has UV. So, super awesome. So this is halfway done. It's already not moving when I push on the edges. So this is gonna be. And if you're wondering what we stirred it with, it our trusty stir sticks in a couple different sizes that we have these available. You have to go in a little bit more. Made of acrylic, you just take a rag with isopropyl, <laughs> is it isopropyl alcohol? My quick coat just poured out of the bottom of this. Whoa. <laughs> oh my gosh. Whoops. Oh, wow. So it's still really warm and a little bit squishy, yeah, it but it's like almost done. In here. It, I accidentally stained the mold when I was doing it. Oh. So client requested 90 of these. Thank you, Clara. Y'all, we have got a really big project coming up. 
that uh, hopefully you guys can be a part of kind of watching. We're sure we can go live downtown. How many tables? 10 times 15. No, not 10 times 15. 10 plus 15. 25. I don't know where that number is. 10, 7, and 8. Yeah, 10 plus 15. Oh, I thought you meant 10 plus 5 is 15. Anyways, so we have to do that many of those size tables and then a bar that looks like this. And we kind of have like, we could do kind of what we want. <laughs> oh boy. Hi, babe. We have Kate Blanchett. Thank you, Trisha. Yeah, hit that thumbs up, y'all. Let them know you're you're here. You say we have Kate Blanchett. Yeah, Kate Blanchett. But yeah, this is like, ooh, that's hot. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we may need help, but I will be letting everybody know as soon as we know. I always feel like I have to take my gloves off to pull these out because I have sticky on my gloves. Do you have sticky on your gloves? Well, y'all remember the song, I Want to Be Your Man? Mm -mm. By Roger. Who's Roger? Roger Nelson. Rabbit? Nope. He is a very well-known... R&B singer from the 70s and 80s. And his brother ended his life. <laughs> oh. Yeah. That's terrible. Sweet, Shot him in the back. Um, but he has a lot of like old school couple skate only songs. Yeah. Couple skate only. I want to be your man. Bam said great. Now it's stuck in my head. So this resin cures up super quick, and well, it's hot. Ooh, it, it's it's wavy. It gets rigid super quick as well, and so you kind of have to Ooh. time it when it's um, when it's a good time to pull these bad boys out. Right now, like it's, it's good, really but warm. I think it'll like I think you'll form it though, like baby. Let's just peel the edges. The seal with the kiss. Ooh, that's hot. It is. <laughs> so, but what I was saying was you have to pull it out before it turns solid or else you, you risk ripping your mold. Right. Because it's tight squeeze. And yeah, it's it's pretty warm. But I'm impatient, so I'm just gonna go for it. Ooh, that's it's really warped, wobbly. It is. But then, that's but you good, can just though. shape it yeah. once it comes out, and that way, tackling it and getting it out of the mold is. Look at that, there. y'all. Ooh. Not too shabby. I understand why they say heat these up. Didn't you, Didn't you say that? Um. Someone told me to heat. Up. Yeah, like you should just do it like right away. So it's like I'm gonna pull that last used one to it. Yeah. What's up, Ooh, Gail? That is like flush. Oh, ow. That's hot. I filled this one up a lot. Yeah, this one's hotter than the other one. So make sure there's nothing sticking to the inside of it, like this. Ooh. And turn it back side out. Back side out, right side out, inside back side out, right side out. Inside upside, right side out. Who's on first? All right, start mixing up resin. I'm trying not to rip the mold. Yeah, they're pretty durable. I was worried about it. The triangle ones are worse. I feel like eight ounces was. I wish I had my, my own setup. Well, my own. 
you, I don't, you what, want, is this one rope? Ro oh, it is. Yeah, it's holding it. It's going, okay, well, I'm going to yeah. return it. Oh, I thought, oh. I used it one time when it broke. It's going back. What do you mean you want your own setup? Like, you want to do white and gold together? No. I, um... Listen to Bobby Brown, so I might, you know, get a little attitude. All right, round number two. With this speed of product, I think I could get these done in a couple of days. So I have a question to ask the fam. Uh -huh. New and um, OGs. Would you guys like it if we went back to the multi-angle cameras? Multi-view. warmer in northern Minnesota today well that's good it's it was in the 50s yesterday but don't forget just like with um, other resins you still need to scrape the sides and the bottom of your this people at home and if you want to get some of this stuff you have to get it from alumalites.com and you can use our code artist till death Nope, don't do that. Use YALL10, Y-A-L-L-1-0. -L -L you just take a little rag with some alcohol on it. Reusable. Sound effect and all. Jeff is all quick draw McGraw right now. She wasn't ready. Ready. Sorry. Well, the paste is thicker, so it takes just a couple oh, minutes. Oh, I should have waited, huh? It's okay. I mean, the resin's going to cure at the same time anyways. I know, but it mixing around. Crevices. Too hot to handle. Too cold to handle. Too cold to hold. For a bunch of children. Climbers under the building. So obviously, the more full you do it. That's crazy how fast that turns. It's like immediate. Yeah. It's like a science project. You, you, you know it. You know Thank you, Vamp. What's up, Jessica? Close to 50 today. We might see spring yet. What? It's only for sale through Illumilite, and you got to use... Um, Y'all 10? Y'all 10. Which is weird for them to have 12% off if the code is 10, but... Um, what do I know? Have you guys used any quick setting resins before? What is your favorite quick setting resin? This is actually the first quick set UV resin that I've used for molds. Um, yes. Get a girl 120. I think that's your name. Did I say it right? Could have been right. Could have been wrong. Who's to say? Um, it is a fast setting white resin from Illumilite. It's called Illumilite White. It's a white urethane casting resin. And it's working pretty good. I almost wish that it was like a four minute working time, 15 minute cure. 
just because it's like uh, eight ounces is more, like maybe, but this is... max. Oh, yeah, Jessica, it's super quick. I know, it changes, like, right before your eyes, too. And it's almost ready to pull out of the mold. We should, like, bring it really close for the next so they can actually... Oh, yeah, let's zoom it in and so you can see, like, up close process. We had a couple bubbles what in that one. What is the resin you are using? Came in... Wait, is it fast? Setting. Yeah, it is, is what super fast setting. Also, next time we we need to pour some in here, some of the whites into this one. Right now it's all gold. All right, it's pretty warm. Yeah. Woo! That is. I almost cussed. Wow. So you can just let it set and cool, but um, we're in a hurry. And also, it doesn't make for very good watching if we just make you guys sit and... God, it's hot. So it Ooh. says, like, what's this the saying? Paint dry? It, we should change it to watching resin cure. What's the saying about watching paint dry? What's that? Or watching water boil or paint dry. What's that saying? Watching paint dry. Yo. What's wrong? It burns. Yeah, it's hot. Zoom in quick. I can feel the heat. Off of Damn, that is hot. We get that last one. I don't know how this song is not canceled. Give it time. It's the Ice Cube song when he went solo. All right, let's zoom in on one so they can see it. Yeah. Is that on in the camera? I see you guys are doing white. What is the UV with one with? Um, Jessica TG actually um, looked it up. Oh, why not? I have some heat protecting gloves, but I'm not going to waste them. Yeah, I'm thinking putting another layer on. Because, <laughs> man, that's like, man, when you push on it and pull the, uh, the product out, I'm going to see if that's any difference. As interesting as watching paint dry. So this could be as interesting as um, watching resin cure. Oh yeah, what was the shirt I want to make? I sent it to you in a text. Resin whisperer. Yeah. Nova I Scotia. I want to visit Nova Scotia so hard. Um, so, yeah, the white and pink was crazy. Um, can you mix mica in it? You can. I'm going to actually mix some metal flake into this one, but you can mix mica into it. Uh, you can also use paste and dyes, but just be advised that... Um, so, what were you telling me the other day about this is A, and it's thinner? That's for the other one. Oh. Um... Use my gun. Okay, so if you use a paste in it, you just have to mix it in really quickly because it's thicker than the 
this resin by a lot. So you gotta just make sure you move really fast. Wonder if you can mix your color into the one part before combining it with the second part to save time. Yes, you can do that, but the reason why I'm not is because then I can't see if I've mixed it, like the part A and part B in properly. You know what I mean? It really doesn't have a smell at all, actually. Yeah, I don't smell anything. I thought it would have a quick coat smell because it is a, a really fast setting resin and quick coat smells like all of death. Thank you, Vamp. Act the fool. I heard Nova Scotia is like super, super pretty. I would love to visit it one day. Nova Scotia? Yep. So I can see the swirls, the angel hair or fishing line of the two parts until it's fully mixed, which ultimately ends up being right before it starts to warm. Like I can feel it starting to get warm right now. Yeah. Go ahead and mix some of this in. Drink yak. Basta. It's not Tourette's, he has headphones. <laughs> I didn't see any comments where I said if you guys want to do the back to the multi view camera shots. Oh, I didn't see they any comments. They want to see either. your pretty face. Well, they didn't comment about it. Okay. All right, you ready? All right, I ready. Middle one. Middle one. Good job. That is pretty. Yeah, yeah that's very. Yeah. I didn't put any paste in this one. It's just, it's all the. We put that one needs more. more gold into this one. It's going to be almost all gold by the end of it. Alright, so keep your eyes peeled on this one. Especially right here, you're going to be able to see it turn white. Oh my gosh. Holy cow. Oh, everyone said yes. Oh, wow. Well, Vamp says yes. Damn, you just want to see my face? No, it says yes, multi view. Hey, hey, yes. There was multiple yeses. How crazy was it? Like, look, I'll rewind this bit. Look, you swirled it. Yeah, it started white when I swirled it. Right here. That's crazy. That's bananas. Love you in your moods, Vamp. <laughs> But it's already like not squishing out. You're gonna have to start with this one. Did you hear me? Start with it? Yeah, because it's all gold at this point. <laughs> no, now your hands are gonna be sticky. It's not sticky. Um, when that resin sets, are any of the exposed parts coming out of the mold with sharp edges? So, if you fill it not all the way up, there are some edges that will have to be sanded. Now we can, we'll take them uh, to this place and have a belt sander. It's got a little bit of a rough edge, but um, if you fill it all the way up, this one it's it just has a little foot and then everything else is level 
But ultimately, if you wanted to, you could pop these out and just get some heat in them. Woo! It's so warm. Um, Jessica, I don't know if it's available in the UK. I know that um, Stone Coat was working on getting... Holy cow. Did you get bit? That is hot. Woo! Um, Stone Coat are working on getting a distributor in the UK. There was a group that had, um, that was doing, like, bulk orders. <sighs> I don't know if they're doing that anymore, but um, if they'll let me start carrying it, I'll ship small batches to the UK. Uh, I wonder if you put white dye in some, it would turn out multi-white. <gasps> the Rip Van Winkle fell the hell asleep. What's wrong? I thought I messed up my back. So I put white dye in this one, and it just kind of all sank. It is like multi-white, you can see. But um, I don't know if it makes enough. I don't know if it makes enough of a difference. That looks so. Let me see. Oh God, it looks so underneath the white on there. Like I don't know if we're gonna be able to put. Cause that's arched like that like putting a sticker on here it depends on how how the letters are well it's not well, we can pick the font I, they're just going to send me a list of letters house of resin in the uk sells it vamp knows all the answers all right this is still super hot but i'm gonna go for it No, I'm not. I'm gonna let I'm gonna let Jeff go for it. Oh. Uh, so I think all this speckling is happening because of the old gold that I'm putting in it. So for example, this one that I did with the dyes that has just resins, bright gold in it, and then this one has the old gold in wow. it. Wow. So it has that metallic reflective edge and um, the color of gold is quite different. That, like, I, I need to not pour the, the clear in first. Yeah, need to give it some room for the gold. So let that be a lesson. The white's gonna take over. It's like when I put my hands like this and then push it, it is like, whew. If you can just get it, like, th then you, you can, you know. It's just that initiation of grabbing the. So like this one, it was all the way full, so it has almost a flat um, base in it. My friend. So I want to show you guys something. Um, I'm thinking about making hats this summer. And obviously if you put on a shirt, but I thought I'm not changing the ATD because I know I've done that a hundred times, but I thought about just like a logo kind of thing. You know how McDonald's has an M. I, I, I got the idea basically from I don't know. Can you see that? Um, from Martin Brothers Customs. His logo is just an M. And I thought that's, I love that. Like I love just the one letter. It's simple, it's nice, it's uh, clean. Um, Todd, we're gonna find out. <laughs> we're gonna find out today how many uses. Todd, Todd asked a good question. How many uses you can get out of these? 
silicone molds, and we we have no idea. Like, oh, you're gonna do remix premix it? Yeah, just to show Clara that it can be. I mean, I'm sure she believed what I said, but just for proof of concept, it can be done. Shut up and take my monies. <laughs> Reminds, yeah, I kind of wanted it. Like, I love baseball hats. Like, I love their logos. You know, it's just a, a, a nice, clean. Um, and I like that old school font, kind of 70s retro. Ugh. That's weird. What do you think it's doing? I'm gonna also put some of this in there. I think it's just being. Rip. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna find out how many uses we can get out of it. So far, we got one, two, three, well, divide that by three. <laughs> I don't know. Well, and all those. So we've done about 22 already. So yeah, so I guess if I just mix it just a little bit past when it starts to get warm, that's about the same amount of time as I can just test the waters that way on if everything's mixed in. I just have to trust myself that I scrape the edges and the bottom and the I think this stuff well is enough. so like it's so thin that if you don't get the sides like all the way like I think it just mixes itself like cause this is like so thin. Yeah they I think they initially started doing this resin for pen blanks. Yeah, just wait. I wouldn't doubt it. Yeah. So tonight is puppy class for Canvas. So that is another reason why we're kind of going live early on top of the fact that we have inventory coming in from everywhere. I need you to not forget that one. Oh, you need to get that last first one. You could swirl these other ones. You can see where your white is still on the sides. Yeah, that's good right now. Babe, that's good. That's in there. It's in there, okay. Yes, puppet classes. <laughs> Holy cow. That is insane. TG said, I sent you heat gloves from Amazon Wednesday delivery. TG, thank you. Where's thank the you, button? TG. That counts as a donation to the channel. No smell. Yeah, it is no smell. At no. all. I mean, probably if you stuck your nose in it, you could smell something, but just don't put your nose in there. I'm getting close, though. And if you're like this far away, you probably could smell, but just don't put your nose in it. I'm gonna get that thing. I'm gonna put them up close. I don't know what you're talking about. Mm. So this first one's gonna have one of those little lips on it that we're gonna have to sand down. Front end. Technically, if my hands could tolerate it, this is good enough to pull. You could pull it already. I don't know 
which one of my favorite is. So while that's curing, you guys tell me if you have a favorite. The ones that we've done. Now I'm going all out, kid. I want to put I want to put them like right here so we can like oh there's a microphone on here yeah sorry about all the movement um so what do you want to do I want to make it to where I can uh like really see Let's see. Yeah, so see, they can really see. No, uh, 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 uh. What's You're wrong? touching the screen. I'm touching the screen. Oh, well, why is it like that? Why do you have it like that? <laughs> why do you have it connected like that? I don't know. Sorry, y'all. There. Yay. Oh, wow. So we're going to pop these out. If you did this with half the white resin and half art coat, do you think the heat from the white would make the art coat cure fast? It would probably cure faster, but Ooh, I don't know. That's a big difference. Um, I don't know. Most people just say don't mix two different resins. We've done it on Ooh. Yeah, I think if we have the back puddled like this, we need to swirl it a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, general rule of thumb is no intermingling. Yeah, that's the fastest way to do that. So which way do you guys like it best? I don't know why you did that. So they can see us mixing instead of just looking oh. at a, an empty mold. So thank you all for watching what we're up to today. Um, if you haven't subscribed, I don't know why you haven't. You're already here watching. So just subscribe. Do one with a kiss pour. You could do that. All right, B, this time we're going to pour, like, pour into one at the, like, same time. Okay. As requested. I'm glad this stuff clears up really quickly. It would be really stressful if it didn't. Like if it was still cloudy and it started warming up. I'd be like, I broke something. I know I did. Hey. 
Gail? Is that Gail? Oh, uh, thank you, Gail. So we have an audience cheering. So that it's one side gold. Yeah, we can do that. It's probably maintenance. Okay, I'll get this, you get the door. Me. Someone has to let him in. Okay, Bowie. Okay, bubs. You told him, okay. All right, Bowie, that's enough. Thank you so much. It was DHL. Just resin. Just resin is here. Oh man. We'll do another one, love. DHL does not let you just. Um, here it goes, changing right before your face. Golly. Watch that. Hey, pretty wow. one. Huh? Whoa. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Appreciate that, Kathy. I didn't get those gold particles mixed in that well, so there's a little floaty floats in there. But that looks good, though. I wonder if you'll be able to feel it. We just may have to spray seal the bottom of it. Ooh, my posse's on Broadway. Posse up. It's already. We know. I'm amazed. Let me be amazed with everybody. <laughs> mm. I need to get some more gloves. Posse up. Me and Kitsitation, the home away from home. How you love phone. The only bad thing is, is I'm, I'm rolling through a lot of gloves. And we didn't um, wipe these off this time because you weren't here. Well, you know, I got 88 kick drum. Kick drum. Um. It is freaky fast, freaky cool, super awesome. Antonio Gordon Jackson. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so, in about another 30 seconds, we can probably pop these ones out. You can see the gold leaving little pockets because I didn't, I couldn't mix it in in time. I'll see you. I guess that's not zoomed in. I was trying to zoom everybody out. What's up, Petra? Long time no see. How are you doing? JJ says, as impressive as the resin in, I'm equally as impressed with the molds holding up. Yeah, that's. I'm really surprised too. Yeah, oh got gold. It's so warm. Oh, wow. 
It feels like that just burns right through the gloves. We're gonna have to seal the inside of this one too because it's got a little gold crater. What I'll probably do with that is just patch fill it with some UV. Ooh. Damn, even that is hot. Holy crap, that like, wow. Look at my fingers. <laughs> a little bit red, a little bit warm. Wow. Which was the kiss pour? Um, that was this one. I am so glad you are doing well, Petra. Yeah, this one is a 50-50. Because it was the closest place to where I was standing. Winter gloves, not a bad idea. You had crazy Canadian geese on your roof? That sounds crazy. So, two more sets with you guys and then class will be dismissed. I would love to be able to do a, um, like a dirty pour version, but I don't think I would have the time. I think it would cure up on me before I could get it out. And it's so thin that I don't know if it would. I don't know. I think it would be too thin. Um, what is up, Alchemy Art by Annette Husband? I believe I took a phone order for you guys today. Um, and yes, Jeff does have grown man zoomies. And he just got squirreled. Um, cotton gloves, yeah, yeah. So Nancy, oh, I'm sorry granddaughter's sick. I hope she feels better. Um, the molds are from Amazon. I have them linked down in the description. Sorry about that. Um, I have the molds linked down in the description under this video. If you guys are interested in the molds, just click on the Amazon link. How many back to back have you made of these molds today? Um, wow. one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. These are like really shiny. Oh, these is resin. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 17. About 20 today. About 20 today. Um, Jeff's just moving everything. But as soon as he gets back, we're going to mix our next batch. I think I'm going to make another gold paste one. It's just when you mix gold paste in, it takes a little bit of a coercion to get it to fully mix in. The first time I mixed a paste in, I was like, this does not look normal. But then it turned out normal, and so I'm unconcerned about what it looks like just here. But as soon as we do this set and the next set, I will take you guys to see all the ones that we have done today. And you can let me know which one your favorite one is.
And y'all, we have a new dust-free zone coming soon in this area. We're moving stuff. We're moving around, making moves, shaking them, shaking them up. Shaking moves. Kissing hands and shaking babies. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um... Okay, so we're going to pour one where you're pouring half of it and I'm pouring half of it. Yeah. Jeff, are you going to video it? Are you going what? Are you going to video the dust um, zone? Yeah, well, we're having our guy, um, our friend Bert, make uh, a big two 48 by 48 planks so we can put two... You know the shelves they sell at Home Depot that are 24 by 48, five shelf? We're putting two of those side by side. And, uh, yeah, we're going to, we're going to make a nice and big dust-free zone. We'll wrap it like we do and put the, uh, LED light in there. Ooh, that's going to look nice. Um, maybe a couple of more gloves. Jeff had, um... I had two on, and it, it, it almost got worse. Like, it, like, sealed the heat in for me or something. The dust free zone, the new one's gonna be 48 by 48 by how tall? Six feet? Six feet. Yeah, and so we'll be filming that process as well. I think I'm mixed. Are you mixed? Yep. Judy! Ready? Yep. Mm -hmm. May were to swirl a couple of those. Pushing on them. Make sure we got no boobles. Closer would be better. Okay. Yeah, it's so far away. That's why I want to go back to the multi cameras. Oh yeah, they'll see that. Look at that. Oh my God, it's happening. Y'all, look at that. It's all gold. Look. Zip. It's like. It's like TV. time lapse. Yeah. It's like real, real life time lapse. How many ounces per coaster are you using? So we're I'm mixing eight ounces for me and eight ounces for him at a time, and we can do three of them. So somebody out there that's smarter three. than me, math that up. Yeah, 16 divided by three, which should be an easy number. Mm, but that's not me. Five ounces. Five and a quarter. Did you math that? Look at you. Five, 10, 15. New edition Bobby Brown button on your sleeve. Uh, Jessica asks, so no heat is required. I haven't used any heat yet. The first set that I did for just um, an example, did um, we did use some heat on it, but I didn't really notice a difference. So we just stopped. Oh, wow. Yeah, don't do that. Don't let it, don't pour stuff and then let it set up and then I pour stuff. Get on it. And let it set up. All right, I'm just going to return this one too. Is it broke? It does the second time I've had one like gap like that. Because we're, I think it's because you let it set and then it. It I doesn't let, you know. I think it's because it looks like this, and it's so warped that it's touching. And so unless we're, like, specific about, like, pulling up these edges and then 
pushing it in there. <clears throat> it's just too warped on these edges. We can do another one. Lisa, be full of questions. I want everybody to be comfortable asking any questions that they need answers to. That's what we're here for. Crash. I know I have some nice clips. But obviously, everybody that, you know, is watching and would maybe do this at home, you'd probably just let it set until it cools off. But I want to show you guys um, what it looks like, and I'm being impatient, and that's fine. But all y'all at home can, you don't have to pull them out this soony. This soony. Making up words. Is that going to put a texture? Mm-mm. Mm. That's fun. It's all swirly in the middle. That is so much better. Look at that. Zip. That's fun. Oh, man. That looks nice. It does look nice. That does not stick to paper. Thank you, Lewis. What? It's peeled off the paper. Did it peel paper with it? Mm -mm. for today because I have two companies of products in-house that I need to inventory. Boop. Boop. I definitely would not advise mixing eight ounces at a time. I mean, 16 ounces at a time, if you're just solo. Yeah, because you start rushing. And... For many reasons, I would advise against mixing anything more than eight ounces by yourself. Would it make you feel better if I gave you some white to mix in to your white? You want me to mix in white? I'm asking. I don't know. Why? Sandy Sanders says, what the heck is this stuff? Demold in two minutes? It's supposed to be ten minutes full cure, but we're cheating a little bit. It is Alumalite white, and it reminds me a lot of the Jesmonite and Aqua Resin that you were showing me. But it's super, super quick. Um, I got just resin and color passion in. So I will be doing inventory on those as soon as we kill the live. So be on the lookout for a coupon code and stuff in your inbox soon if you are subscribed to our newsletter. And if you're not subscribed, then do do it. Everywhere. I think if I didn't have this super quick resin, I would have to order so many of those molds to get all these done in time. 
What's up, Libby? Oh, I know. It sets so quick. It's so cool. Oh, I know. The gold looks so phenomenal because it's the metal gold, so it floats on the top like 007. Yeah. Wait for me. It always looks better when they're swirled. Trying to scoot them all it's, into camera. It's like getting okay. hot. I'm going to hijack the plane. Whoa, that looks great. Like, you have to stop at some point because it'll... That's so rad. Woo! Only tabby tappies. I think that kind of mixes. Kind of swirl. Whoa! That's so rad. Look, it looks like little roses. Uh... All right, I'm taking it. So, these are about one minute from Demold, if you want to stay and watch that. Meantime, I mean, they're not going to do anything other than get um, more rigid. I want to know which one you guys uh, fancy the most. I think it's going to be a nice set for the graduation party. So they're all going to have um, a monogram letter decal in the base of them. So I can use this in all of my deep pour molds. I am not sure about that one. I'm not sure what um, the recommended depth is. This one is about a quarter inch all the way around, except for in the middle, because it kind of bulbs up a little bit right here in the center. Um, so that's probably close to a half inch in the center part. But I guess depending on how deep pour you're going, also check out my this. Super proud. Don't know what I'm going to do with it. Look at, look at her just chasing something. And yes, she's still working on not using pee pads. So when you do a swirl, it you can see it. Mm -hmm. It's it, well, it's it's when you do it right when it's starting right about to set up. I think. Look at that June bug. 
I would save so much resin if the middle wasn't so bulby. So would you guys like to um, watch when we do the monogramming of are these? Is that something that would interest you guys in seeing? Um, Vamp, I think right now the thought is to put the monogram down and then since it's like just a little crevice down there, just putting just a little bit of like art coat to just further seal it in, you know? So this is how many we got down today in 71 minutes. We did 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 9, 20, 21, 22, uh, 24. We got 24 done in nice. 71 minutes. So I think we'll be able to get these done in no time. Uh, I will um, film the decal process slash stream it for you guys. And yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you guys learned something, were entertained or otherwise educated. Thank you for everyone that tuned in. Please subscribe if you haven't. And, um, and if you have, thank you. And thank you for the donation. And this is my big boy Bowie, if you didn't know it. <laughs> my babe. Yeah, please leave me your likes. Thank you, Alchemy Heart. This is my other biggest boy. My baby boy. All right, you guys have an awesome evening. We'll see you guys tomorrow at 2 p.m. where we let the box decide what color we pour with. Hope you all have an amazing day. Be kind to one another because you never know what someone's going through. Always remember, we do the tests. So you don't have to. You guys are amazing. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye.